So when I was contacted by Figure Hugger and they asked me if I wanted to try one of their slimming kind of dresses, I wasn't sure what to think because part of me sort of thought, oh God, that's really embarrassing. But to be fair, I am always looking for something that's going to hide all my lumps and bumps and God knows I do have them. So I agreed and it came, I wasn't super excited about it and then I tried it on and it actually really, really is exciting and really works. But the basic concept behind it is that it's shapewear or slimwear, but with a kind of young, fun twist. So you know how classically kind of shapewear are always um, very kind of boring and look really ugly and just not something that you'd ever kind of want to be seen wearing. These aren't, they're very kind of fun and colourful and have a, a younger look to them. So if you were wearing it like under your dress, nobody would really um, question the undergarment, if that makes sense. They're made from really, really fit, thick fabric, kind of like swimming costume fabric. And this is just what it looks like. I will show you it on and that soon, so just kind of ignore that part of it, but that's what it looks like. And the, um, how these are made are very, very difficult to get on. It states that it comes with kind of like a little do's and don'ts of the figure hugger slip, which is really cool. So it tells you kind of don't try it on without reading it. Um, do expect it to be tight. Don't try and put it on over your head. Um, don't wash it in certain things. So that's really cute. But they are £50, which is expensive for slimwear. Um, I'm not sure if that's kind of a price point that would appeal to everybody. But I really think it does work and it really does help to kind of slim down your lumps and bumps. It isn't perfect. I do think that it could slim down your front a little bit more, but um, it is definitely something that's worth trying if you do feel self-conscious and you wear a lot of kind of body con dresses and things like that and you want something that's really gonna hug um, your figure and kind of really let everything um, look smooth and give you a really lovely clean silhouette. My main issue with these is the colour selection that they do, because it's kind of targeted at a younger market, they want it to be very fun and girly and the colours are very bright which I suppose would be okay if you wore that sort of clothing but um, it's hard to kind of wear underneath certain things because it would show and I really do think that a white and a black and a nude even should be introduced. Now the makers are adamant that they don't want a nude to be introduced because that's kind of very stereotypical of shapewear but I think maybe a dark dark nude would be something that a lot of girls would um, find very useful. I know a black would be really, really useful and they are going to introduce a black on their website later on, but it really does make you look like you've just lost a little bit of weight and gives you that kind of Kelly Brook body versus the kind of little bits of chunk that hang around everywhere. So I am gonna insert some footage now of me wearing it. Um, well, I'm gonna insert footage first of me not wearing it so you can see what I look like in just a regular bodycon dress and then what I look like with this underneath my bodycon dress and you can see the difference. And you can also get this kind of like lace slip thing where you can kind of style it in a way that goes over the top of the dress, which um, does look very pretty as well. I don't know if it's kind of my style personally, but I'm gonna show you what it looks like anyway, and you, then you can really see the effect of how um, much so difference So I've deliberately chosen a dress that's very, very tight and figure hugging, get it, that showcases all your kind of lumps and bumps, and because I've got studio lighting in here now, I'm sure I'm gonna then look at it in the camera and be mortified, because the lighting's gonna pick up on everything. But as you can see, this kind of area just looks a little bit lumpy. You just get that kind of little bit of chubby on your tummy. Um, I am wearing kind of high-waisted knickers which does help control that um, but it's still you kind of get just a little bit of your lumps and bumps showing and definitely kind of here which is the kind of saddle bag area for me. It just shows that your body isn't perfect and how many kind of little bulges and things you have. You can sort of see on the back as well you just get that little bit of a bulge so that's what it looks like without it. And then I'm going to put it on underneath and show you how it's wearing out the figure hugger underneath. And you can see the difference that it makes. But the only thing is the fabric of the dress that I'm wearing is very thin. So you can probably kind of see the lines in places like the bottom part, which is right here. It has got this kind of... Um, sort of silicone strips that are meant to stop it from moving but the thing is where the fold part is it does kind of bulge a little bit so it would be better if you wore it with something maybe a little bit looser but it's not the end of the world and you can't really tell but as you can see it really does smooth everything out it's very tight you do kind of feel a little bit restricted and a little bit like you can't breathe but um not you know in a major kind of corset way you just kind of feel a little bit restricted but you can see how it really does help to kind of just smooth everything out and gives your body a really nice silhouette the only place that i think it could do with a little bit more improvement is kind of on this area but i'm not sure if 
process more my body because obviously my chest isn't that large and it kind of um, squishes the girls down a little bit and then my waist is small and it's kind of not as tight as it should be on my waist area but then it is very tight on the other part so here it really sucks everything in which is fantastic and it's really great on your kind of bum area as well because I feel like it lifts it a little bit I've got a very fat bum so it kind of just lifts it a little bit and really makes everything look smooth and nice and <coughs> I'll even be brave enough and show you what it looks like underneath because that might be helpful to some of you, but that is what it looks like on. So you can see that if, you know, your boyfriend walked in on you dressed like that, he'd probably quite like what he saw and not think that you were wearing some scary outfit. But I will now show you what it looks like with the lace insert over the top and how you could start like that. If you wear a kind of lace to. insert over the top, this is what it would look like. Now, it's a really sexy look and it's a really nice look, but personally, um, just from kind of personal taste perspective, I wouldn't wear it over something coloured. I would only ever wear lace with black. I just that's the only way I like it. I think otherwise it can look a little bit too sort of underwear like and especially red and black although it's very sexy it is very kind of reminiscent of sexy underwear so I don't think I would wear this out personally but um, it is a kind of very Kim K type of look and it is really flattering like I feel like my body looks really really good in it it's just the colour scheme um, if I get a black one I would totally totally wear this over the black one and go out like it and it would be great but this is what it looks like on and I'm sure you can see it really really does make a difference and it makes your body look great it just kind of feels a bit sad that your body doesn't look like that when you take it off things just kind of spread out a little bit but on it makes everything look amazing so that is what it looks like on and I think you'll all agree it does really really make a good um, difference the only thing that I think maybe could be done would be to make the straps thinner so the straps um, if the straps were thinner it kind of would be easier to hide because obviously the, the straps are quite thick and that could be a problem if you're wearing like a little skimpy bodycon dress that was strapless or something like that maybe if you kind of had like a strapless one that had detachable straps that might be better I don't know but that's just my opinion on it anyway and I will put all the information down below for you to go and have a look but it's really great for this time of year because it's the time of year where we all want to look really good but the thing is you go out a little bit and you probably drink a bit too much and eat a little bit too much chocolate and that kind of thing but you still want to look good and if you try and kind of make sure that you've eaten before you've gone out and then you put this on you will look instantly slimmer it is just an optical illusion you're not kind of going to make yourself be thinner but you will make yourself look better and I know there'll be people out there sort of saying oh but it's trickery and it's not real and all that kind of thing but that doesn't matter if it makes you feel good that is all that matters that's the most important thing if you feel good and you feel sexy and you feel like you look good then don't listen to what anybody says. I think it's great, um, but I will put all the information down below. As I said, make sure you read your little leaflet if you get one, and let me know if you've gotten one and how you feel about it as well, and like what you've worn it with and that kind of thing. I can't wait to wear mine to parties and people will be like, wow, you look so thin. <laughs> You could keep, but it says down here one of the things actually, don't be mean, do tell your friends why you look so good. But I think if it's someone you haven't seen for a while, let relish in the compliments, you don't have to be honest about it. But um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. And as I said, those are kind of my thoughts about it and my kind of um, little critiques, but they contacted me and it wasn't something I was aware of and I thought it'd be really cool to share it with you guys because it's something that, as I said, I didn't know. So I'm assuming other people didn't know. And if you want to feel good, but you still want to look good, um, and not feel frumpy, then this is the answer for you really. So I hope you enjoyed this and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.